Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Hello? Mr. T. Yes, yes. Good evening. How are you? Fine, fine. Thanks. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you for your message. You know, this school of no social and understand. And that's why we post share compliments of the season on Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank you. Hello. 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 Yes, please. Good evening. Good evening. Ah, we have to go for my survey. Yes. Yeah, I'm quite. Now, I'm going to survey. I'm going to survey. I'm going to survey. Yeah, survey. Number, Mr. Dad. Hmm. We're going to have to go to the show. We're going 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 to go so I put him on the phone. Hmm. Mwalando kwa because as Zambians, what we want is the best, not the good, but the best. You said the other report is is good at the moment. Yes. Why can't you be the best? Myself. So you can't be the best. Yeah. You like you seem to be knowing and knowing it all. Very good. Aba mwasa kisa muri inshila. Aba mwasa kisa muri inshila. Tume na kwati mbimu e na mufishi ba fiance. Why can't you be the best? Like any mia suki. Why can't I be the best? Ine na HH. Mungu vukisha vuno vuno. Ine na HH. I am better than HH. I'm telling you. Me being president, I'm better than HH. But the issue is, the issue is, I am not anywhere near to presidency. I'm not anywhere near to presidency. And why? Uh -huh, why? Being near to presidency, mm. it takes a lot. Number one, it requires resources. It requires resources. Mm -hmm. So even myself, when I'm saying me, I'm better than HH, I am sure there are also better mm -hmm. people than me. A lot of them out there. Mm -hmm. But being close to presidency, number one, it requires mm -hmm. a lot of investment in terms of resources. That is number one. In terms of resources, mm -hmm. for example, I mean, you are talking about millions of dollars. Millions of dollars to become president. I want to, not that, you know, because the uh, or whatever. People must know you. Yes. But for you to go around the okay. entire country, you must know you. But for you to go around the entire country, it requires a lot of mm. money. That campaign you talk mm. we talk about. Mulamona if you are chopa e makwati fi paso. Yai mayai kalapa. Yai mayai kalapa. Just to hire a chopa mm. on average, on average is four hundred thousand dollars. Four hundred thousand mm. dollars. Where na la ifunya kuisai. So in terms of resources, I'm very mm. far. And then nangunai watio. Okay. Ndi se pano pan pa social media. Ndi se campaign. Ngachako wati imu mweva Ntumulefilo kumjafua Ukuli pirama lawyers 50 pin ya shupa 10 pin ya shupa No mbanga ma dollars Ya la moneka That is so ama resources they are needed Number 2 Mkala mba wanti Number 2 you need to have connections Iyo connection iyo Ana mweva ntu Tuila iwe pati yo wanti fevaima Vaya posa mama vote, vaya posa mama vote, atu wawaka teka. Awe, there are a lot of forces, invisible hands, that are at play before one becomes a president. Before one becomes a president, there are a lot of invisible hands, including these foreign nations. They have got interest. 
They pump in. Eba leta ne mpia. Eba leta na maa observers. Muna mwenye maa observers wa sangati. Na wa mikamu na wa kukuchita kampeni. Na wa kukuchita shani. Na wa kukuchita shani. Invisible hands. You must have that connection. Ine pano mwari njishiva imwe. Yes, thank you very much. But ni wa anga wa mbia wa njishiva outside the country. If you could live here, I'm a business community. Nivanga, I don't have. HH had that. HH had the money. Mm -hmm. HH had the connection. Even now, a pale taker. A pale that even mm -hmm. to debt restructure, you need those connections. Because if you don't have those connections, those, but I have a quarter of the bigger powers. Kukula kula risha feo that toala kumona. And they will make sure that if you are shupa, so that watashani wafirwa. Like what happened in Zimbabwe? Zimbabwe. Okay. Zimbabwe when Mugabe was there. They didn't like him. Those bigger mm. powers. What did they do to Zimbabwe? Look mm. at Zimbabwe. Mugabe was not a bad leader. But those people, the invisible powers, they worked on mm. Zimbabwe and made Mugabe look bad. So this is what I'm talking mm. about. If I had the resources, if I had the connections, the connections, the right connections. Then you put in a mirror to buy a church in a in 2026 to rain banana in a But for now, I'm wondering, I don't know from myself. No man, don't say that. Okay, you must know that is your opinion. Okay, that's good. Now, since we need to give chance to others, my other question is you know that we have. They have been observing the politics, how people are, are being finished in the politics. Can't you realize that for you, today you support this one, the other day you support that one. This is how Bernard Shimbagambuidi and the others, have, uh, their political careers are doomed. Now, can't you realize for yourself? Because we see you to be a future leader. Now, if you start, you go this side, you go this side, people don't know your stance because what they can see. Since the current president entered into politics, he has been in one part up to today, up to date. Now for you, it's like you are, you know politics have changed now. But Michael said that changed from UNI, PMMD, and what he did, until he met his, his own political party, and he went. He didn't support anyone, because that's a law and that's that. But for you, you see you support this one today, Let's, let's hope in 2026, as you have said it, it, you remain to him. You will, along the way, you will not change to say, no, this time I'm supporting him, or Listen, this time I'm going to Kalaf. You have, let's you, hope so. You have made, you have made a you point. Wait a minute. What, is, what you have seen you as Zambians. Let me respond to you. Already you have made a point. Yes. You have made a point. You yes. see, it takes wisdom and intelligence to realize the truth. It takes wisdom. So sometimes umundunga takwe temano. It is not my fault if he cannot realize my point. For example, there was a time when I was supporting Valungu. Tuwa Valungu boerele nipo. Valungu ba ikerefe mutu. And he was scandalizing. was scandalizing the current one. Let 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 me finish. I'm 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 I'll give you. I'm telling that it requires wisdom and intelligence to see the point. And if somebody doesn't see the point, mm -hmm. it is not my problem. So, like I was, I was trying to give you a point that Valungu, there was a time when I was saying Valungu mm. kutiwa because Valungu, like I'm saying, Valungu has got potential to raise those resources. Valungu has the connection as a former former head of state, and Valungu had the experience of running the country. At that point, mm -hmm. I was busy campaigning by 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 Edgar Lungu. And of course, when you are campaigning for one person in politics, you have to damn the other one. I have to damn HH. <laughs> and Balungu, Bali Kerefie, Bali Fuma, he couldn't take an opportunity of the situation that arose. He didn't. And when he didn't, I saw that okay. I changed. I changed. So I changed not because. Uh, Nine, I'm, I'm just a, a whimsky person who just goes everywhere. No, mm -hmm. I realize that mm -hmm. no, I'm mm -hmm. today I'm saying my mm -hmm. HH is on the right trajectory and he has started a campaign for, 20, for, for his second term. I'm going to support him. Mm -hmm. But look, 
If Mairo, wa HH wa afuma muishira, wa tampo kukolua, wa tampa corruption, you think I should continue supporting him? No ways. And who are kwata manu, he will be able to realize, to say, echo tayari ya chingisha, ni icho wa HH, na wa mbo kukolua, ni icho wa HH, na wa afuma muishira. But we don't shkwe tamanu. That's good, okay. But we don't shkwe tamanu. Okay. You will say, tayari, ala chinja mm. chinja. In the chinja, I always give okay. reasons. Okay. So my brother, now what I can advise you, see the words that you are using before, because you never know where you are going. So when you are scandalizing someone. I, I don't I scandalize. Mean, I don't scandalize. What do you mean scandalize? I don't no, scandalize. You do. No, okay, tell me which scandal. Okay, fine. How? Okay, if you don't get it, okay, in short, do not damage so much. No, I have to you. damage it. That's the way that I get it. Manu, na randa, ta ta I have to but tell you. But we are saying that you don't have, um, you have no stance. This is what we are saying. Ah, when I'm wet, I'm wet, I'm wet, I'm wet, I'm wet, then if I want to wrap it, it's moved for sure. Ah, when I'm wet, 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 of an hour, the rowing gap on the way of your dog with the stance, dog with the stance. Think what a stance, and I've got, I'm even courageous to follow my stance. I'm even courageous. Others have don't have courage. You know, I've got the courage to take my stance, and I follow that stance. I'm not going to have to wait the stance. This stance, a panic water stance. Stancing with their God, HH, Gatta Wino. I'll follow him. But in Gana Monata, the Chita Wino, I change off my moon shield. I will change my stance. And that is my stance. So how can you say I don't have a stance? We shall not shimulia manom. Ala. Tia nabu to my number phone is 0970-0763-302207. So I am in Tabala for the I can't. If you can't see my point. I can't put na in between na mi pepper la coffee. Eh, I can only pray for you that you see reason. But otherwise, from my point of view, I don't just do things. I always have reasons, and I even come here and tell you if I change my position, I come and tell you to say why I've changed the position. It's because of this and that and that. But if you don't see it, you are just, no now change it. No, if you don't have your change, now you go change. Should you just stay? I do know. Now learn that 2026 will come support the HH. In case of what you are, you are not going to be able to do it. And they have got an equity of uh, 49% against 51%. In case of what you are, you are not going to be 49%. 20% are going to HH. You should look at what you are. The deception. I said, you are not going to be able Whatever the forty nine percent is going to Zambians, now can you move twenty percent? I will not accept that. And you think I'm going to allow you? To, I'm going to continue? And just because Nadia the social media to say no, I'm supporting HH. No, ngalufi anyam dara kum chinsha mano. Hey, hey, ngafia mi pa kum chinsha. You are the support of Walungu. Hey, Walungu, fume ni fume ni fume ni. But make it if you are this. Na pape ni Walungu walisa. Eh, what is he doing? What is he doing? Where is he? Politically, where is he? Ukula kupata na picture, ni lowa kupata picture, wali so, ni lowa kista shani shani, kwa ati ni, ni nani kane, ni, ni ati, ati shani, ati, ati, eh, ati shani, wali ya, ati, wali ya, ati shani, kwa ati, beauty contest, eh, wali ya, awe na, Rodi, Roland Musiska, wali ya, ati shani, wali, eh, ama model, models, Eh, ni model, the law of Wabu called Chiro, a picture now which does so. My Wabu now which does so. Emma politics. My politics in Dara Kufuma Kufuma. Eh, could I be a fika be the wire? But ever to look quick at the wire while the singer, a quick at the winning of cooking at the babuka. Emma politics. In end of Manalef, my pile now feel at Balungu. Could you work a poker up a gate? Nadia, Kirikit Naya, I posa. Eh? Mu street, ndi ya punda na kupunda Kui posa E eh, kukosa E eh, ma politics Not na mwika na munga Nda mwile pelo tuma statements E eh, tumairo press conference Mwa hapa press conference Mukia kabisira Nama questions You can't even allow journalists to ask you questions And you say Yo, 
e e e e vale a coisa lá por tete fumbe mdala tete fumbe kuka lá vana ma politics kuka sa tien tu men Martin muita tina tu men tu men tu men tu men zero pa WhatsApp call me on WhatsApp zero seven six three three zero two two zero seven Tu meni, tu meni, mairo isha garande. Mairo isha garande, nika lashisha malata kugwa nzu. Muke sana mkushita kwa malata. Mwaisa, mwaisa njombola kwa malata, ndeshi isha malata. I'm selling roofing sheets now. At Guanzu Roofing Company. Mwaisa, mwaisa nsapotako. Mwaisa, mwaisa nsapotako. Mwaisa kwa malata. Hello? Hello? Hello. Yes, please. Hello. Yes. Um, mawom. When you are tired, I'm quiet. I'm quiet, mawom. Ben. How to be able to walk around? But when I talk, I'm quiet. 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 But uh, this is the issue with most of the Zambian people, is that they like to criticize even when they don't understand issues. Yeah. Hence, these politicians that don't mean anything good for the Zambians, they capitalize on that. Because they are not able to say, and they think a politician is a wise man, is the only one who has got the, the eyes to see good things, and themselves they feel if we if we do better than this one. You know, they, they were in government for, for 10 years, they worked there, they did their best which they could. What more is it that they are going to do when they are brought back in power? Nothing. If not that they will come to root more than what they have done already. Or to come and protect the things that they have been hiding all this time. So, like you said, to say, the best man that we have at the moment is the president. Let's engage him, let's help him to get to somewhere because he means well. I was thinking today to say, the way we behave sometimes, Zambian people, is that we behave like a wife who sees the husband going to work tirelessly and still come back and shout at him to say, you are just going to see women and everything and so on. You see, this is how the Zambian people think to say, in, in, in a position of a president like him, can go to America to go and do window shopping rather than going to sit down and, and, and analyze and see the solution to the problems Zambians are going through. So, even if he's a bad man, me, I feel he, he can't be perfect in all things that he does, but he has Zambian people on his mind. Thank you. And he's trying by all means to do what he can do. Thank you so much. Thank you, my brother. Hello? Hello. Hello. Good evening. Good evening, sir. How is evening? Yeah, it's okay. I'm feeling good. Are you coming to Guangzhou to buy some roofing sheets? Uh, currently, uh, I've already uh, I've already bought roofing sheets. Wow. I've just remained with I've just remained with the with the planks now. Okay, no. Next time, or if you see someone who is looking for roofing sheets, refer them to uh, my company. I want to make money. Please go ahead. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, uh, Edmund, I've, I've got only two points mm. which, I would like, which I would like to share with the other callers and you. Mm. One, mm. one, you have said that the, 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 our president is the only person who can save us right now here in Zambia. Mm. But myself, I can't support that because 
na tukua tenko ngole shini sana mm-hmm. andi tuwa likuwa ta ama precious stones mm-hmm. since 1964 up to now mm-hmm. tapa wawa stapa benefits na ngomo kuma precious stones I mean kuma uh, kuma nantani ayotua ayotua kwa tamu mzami tapa wa no one kuma minerals yes then Yeah, yes, yes, I am yes. Mm-hmm. So, in end of condemn each president who is a poku kongola, mm-hmm. each president who is a poku kongola. Mm-hmm. The police can't mm-hmm. The only thing what they, they can do, ila god wa sendiri kula ko ya pot. Ni state wa ba kongwe ba ba imba se wapanga no tuna ma block block ya ya god wa lipiri na mwen kongole. F chitaba F cream, wa F cream ngana ba kwata, ngana ba kwata Nala wakata project wa Kongo la FMP kula kwa inawa mkongo la kwa F ku ku IM achikushani kwa MF ku aha mm. elonga wa Kongo la matampo ku bali kulipirira mukopa ifo finto fo twa ishiwa mm. ni Kongo ni shapwa nomba ifo ni nji bali se fikatorize pali ifo ene fo e bantu aba ba PF efo twa vote yo kufinya po PF kwa bati aba bali po bachinje Apandera ndaso apandera ndaso brother wandera pa kukana kuti kwa mabenz amenz mm. but yonze wale ndo kwati cdf 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 yala kumana temu no mbali so ava namo bali sha ina nkane kafra after dam ise dia kwa ati mapuri kishoko of cdf zero avantu mundo la bali la sha amenz shinge ko tingala ndi pa kwati wa wombera kwa kuteko things are not good or, or even if we have got the president who can help us to solve some 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 other problems nothing is happening thank you for our president thank you my brother thank you he has made a good point jim hello hey hello 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 machisha m kwa m shanaim uno nebo mteri kundola ndifu <laughs> Londora Very good. Sumina. And indeed, if you're not a leader, they don't have to figure it out. 
in the sense that bale chita celebrate and yet shiyen kongole ni chitavala kwata agreement na chachi meleno china china na kano kusaina they haven't signed so what i said then and what is happening today it has come to pass but now lelo ndevo kwevati nangu chave fi kwevati at the moment that to sign we should not celebrate that yo tida to ala ndire chawa mate papa eh to alive that you are celebrating before you sign te papa mo afirwa to ichite fyo yo tie ntrole she pachalo chesu pandunga chakwa tava sign eh next year tukachita default tukaba muchive if you underland so if you are not in she change she yo i'm just bringing back the point to say yes they celebrated early they celebrated too early but today where we are we should not celebrate to say te papa va firwa we should try as much as we can to support them so that va sign me pantu nga tava sign me tukaba muchive you can now go ahead my brother Hello? Mm. 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 Ndiye <laughs> it means tukatampo tu, we must pay we must start paying and if into na fishu palelo no mba imagine next year nga to watch that default to kanok to filo to atampo kulipira chikawa shani so from my point of view i have not changed anything i was saying apart into na fishu pa tatulambo tatulambo kulipira in congo and if on there and another local but about if they fail to strike that in, restru, uh, restructuring deal if they fail It means we have to start paying. Eh iyo ndera ndokoeva ati ndesovela. Ukoeva ati if we start paying things will be difficult. So ine mune, she change she. I'm still saying the same thing. Go ahead. So mba shiyango ngure shi mwa ti shiyeti chita affect as it are because it's a mambo kubisha. Inkongole shiyeti chita affect. Yes. And the number one for number. Iyo question wa chimuna ko ipchati. So how is the debt affecting us now? How the debt is affecting us now? Ni ya kwevati. Nam kwata finana chira London kwevati ulabomba. Neno. Hello? 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 Uyumulumendo na kwata sana mano ni mutemwe chine chine ndefa mutumine kwa 100 kwa cha fe ya mabandos ndefa mutumine kwa fe 100 kwa cha ya mabandos uyumulumendo na alitemwa bantu ali kwata mano mwa icho alo mfwa elo ala sungira fe yosefo na liranda na afiranda i like such people ah na phone ya putuka ya ya putuka mulumendo iwe ndefwa ya Ushen kuisa ishishiwe namba ile I want to send you a hundred kwacha for bundles pantulo mfa bwino bwino sana Hello 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 Yes yes Mkwai. <laughs> Na vachi tesi tita vaya background tiba alonda uti tisi inti kuchiti tisi iso na so kubandu tava alonda ula. Ehe semu apply zina itukuna alire uku atipaka awe dreads. 
So to be honest with you, me I can I can I'm coming in a different direction, I would say, but boss now I feel it's not about the connection, it's not about the uh because look at Pombe, Pombe Makfuli, mm-hmm. uh, the, the former president of Tanzania. Mm-hmm. He wasn't moving too much. No. He just used his resources. Mm-hmm. You know, the resources which God given him and he, he applied the rule of law and discipline in the country. The country, uh, the, 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 the country in Africa became a number one in terms of economy. Mm-hmm. They started paying off the debts. Mm. So really, what we are lacking is, is literally nothing. And then again, we cannot always to measure ourselves with a dollar, uh, a American dollar, where we don't do business. Why don't we shift, go to yen with China, where we do business? <laughs> okay, now, so listen, my brother. Um, I hear you. You are basically saying this country is very rich. We have got wealth, yes. which is more than 20, 20 trillion dollars. And what is it that you are talking about? A 17 billion. What is that? It's nothing. Now, here is a point, my brother. That wealth that you are talking oh. about, in terms of minerals, that wealth that you are talking about, it is not wealth that you can readily access. It is a wealth that needs investment for you to get it out. And for you to, to get that investment, to get it out, we don't have the investment ourselves as Zambians. We don't have the investment. And that is where we need other people to come and invest in the mines so that they can be able to access those minerals. Otherwise, we will have what we have in Chingola, where our brothers were digging using a Iminwefie and when I am going to watch the Bakoswe and at the end of the day Chava Dirikira and up to now we are still struggling to get them. For us to get that wealth, for that to get that wealth, we need that investment. But that investment to come, that investment to come, our economy must be stable. It must be stable. Because if it is not stable, that those people who have got investment will not come into the country. And this is where HH is doing all these rounds, going to these countries where there is possible investment, so that he can woo that oh. investment to come into the country. So you cannot get those minerals. If a 20 million to amba fiokula imbo kula imba, namakasu. We will never get those minerals. We need the machinery. We need the technology. And that technology, that machinery, we don't have it. Who has it? It's the people where HH goes. Okay. Okay. Let me come in. Let me come in this way, Mr. President. I'm not trying to, to catch on your time. But no, please go ahead. Yes. Mm. Uh, the CCM... Mm was not run by white people, primarily it was run by uh, black people, like by George Chuye, yes. Kaunda Limbalimba, those managers. Yes. And when you look at when you look at the CCM audience, mm. or when you look at the CCM by that time it was RCM, yes. Ankana, yes. Compamine, you know, Ruansha Compamine, all those kind of things. Uh-huh. When you look at that period of time, mm. the production was okay, the, 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 the accident we are less, but yes. we are run by Zambians. Yes, but the the people who put in the money, it was it was the outsider. Yes. So now, mm. uh, why do we always look for outside when we have people can run the mines here? Because even the Chinese, they don't know how to run the mines. You can find the Chinese with canvas and tropicals underground. Yes. So you see, but Zambians, they know how to run the mines. Yes, but do why they do we have, have always ma- have too much confidence outside than leaving the. Uh-huh, the issue is not about is not about human resource. The issue is about capital investment. That's the difference. We 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 may okay. have people that know how to do mining. The challenge that is there is mm-hmm. that they don't have the 
capital investment. Capital investment to bring those heavy machinery which cost a lot of money. And yes, there have been arguments whereby people say, no, but why don't, why don't we also go and borrow? Because these Chinese who come, they also don't come with their money. They also borrow. The issue that comes in there is that for us, for you and I, my brother, to go and borrow money in China, it is practically impossible. But for the Chinese, it is easier. For the Western countries as well, for you and I, my brother, for us to go and borrow money from, let's say, a, a, some of these financial institutions in Europe, it is hard. <coughs> a black man, Chirufetayari, na iwe na inetuwa senda na nutuma briefcase, tule ya tukongo na inda na ku Europe. They will not give us. But our rutenkanda, our sungu banavo, they will give them the money. And this is where the problem comes in. You and I, we cannot access the money. And that is what H.H. was also talking about, which he, when he presented in, 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 in France, he said, if we are Africa, to get money, it's very difficult. And if we have to get that money, it is on high, high interest rate. But for their fellow Zungus, they get it easily and at a cheaper, uh, cheaper cost. So that is the challenge that we have. And for us to succeed, unfortunately, it needs us bootlicking. It needs us going back and forth to them, pleading with them. And this is why I'm saying HH is not wrong to go back and forth to these countries because he's trying to negotiate with those who have the economic power, the capital investment, which we need. Okay, but, but there are the president. Sorry, I know a lot of people, this is a big program for you. But lastly, yeah. I, I received investors who wanted to invest in Mopani and Copper Mine, and they were ready even to pay off the Grenko and to pay off Vandeka. I pushed in the letter, and I'm sure State House has got that record. Okay. Now, because of the people surrounding the president, I'm sure, if never reached him, but a lot mm. who surround the president, I've got those copies and the documents, I have them. Mm. They were ready to clear early, early, the time he just uh, became a president. Mm. But everything was pushed away. I'm the eyewitness. And you, my guys, who were investors, they became frustrated and they wanted to, to bring big money, not even the small money, they are begging for uh, IMF. Mm. And they wanted to do that on, on a humanitarian ground, whereby the paying of back that money should come out of the profit. You see? Which was a very good condition. Yeah. But now, what I'm trying to say is this. That's why I'm saying that woman on Jikwati Usu, Te Usuma. Because sometimes even the people na Kanyerele. Things. Mm. You see? Mm. What we need now is not to get money. What we need now is better system. We give them we give them copper, they give us the machinery. Okay? We give them equipment because when you give them copper and they give you paper, they just print those paper. There's no value. Mm. Yeah. No, you I, I hear There's you, no my value. I hear you, my brother. I hear you, my brother. Don't worry. Keep those contacts. When I'll be president, we might need those people. We might bring them. Thank you. Okay, okay. thank you, sir. So, if you want, you see, I want to, I want to go back to that point that that young man made. That young man said, "You said the HH and the UPND." Let me pick this one. Hello. Hello? Hello? My brother, man, how are you? I'm fine. How are you, Mr. Tiago? I'm okay, thanks. I'm okay, thank you. Good. Come season. Yeah, uh, Mr. You know what it is, my brother? This what's happening is this. In Zambia, I know you can, can say that 
the network here hello ah lord oh lord you can call again hello hello yes please hello yes please you can go ahead oh, oh. Hello? But the line was very bad. Yes. Yeah. Yes, yes. Are you, get, are you getting me now? No, it's breaking, but let's see. Go ahead. Hello? Go ahead. Uh, yeah. Yes. Yes. Uh, the president said the issue of and everything at Ninka Niache at Yamumova. You see? So. Ingankale Bwanji Kani Yamumo wa Mr. Tayare. We says here in Zambia that we can make money. So why the president was saying that no Shovu, Shidra Itandi, these minerals in Kani Yamumo wa? No! We have this in Zambia. And what it is, these whites is what they want. They just want to come and grab minerals. That's why they give us money. Do you think that this that they are giving us is just for free? The answer is no. That's why we are seeing a lot of whites coming to Zambia. You see? Uh, because they want something. Eh? It's not that no, because we are, eh, we are friends to the whites and this and this. No. There is something that they want. Let me tell you. Come 2026. People, they are tired. You know, these two years, being like we are in prison. I'm telling you, somebody can't make me. When you make money, they send police. When you, and this, it's a lot of, a lot of problems. So, I, Indians brought money in the country to make that law, dear Kush, Lord. Mm. You know that the money was seized. You see? Seized. Eh? You can't do anything to do this and this, they want to union you. So those are the things that is happening. We can't do anything. Yeah? You so, 2026, Mr. Tari, I'm telling you. Thank you. Come, come, next year, come, ne come next year February. How much will be the millimeter? Uh, how much will be the millimeter? You tell me. This platform up again, and I will ask you to say that Mr. Terry, Bunga Manja for 850. I'm telling you. Eh. Thank you, my brother. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, that was a, a serious. Uh, my brother is very upset. He's very upset. But look, actually, this point, uh, let me make this point also um, uh, to the UPND. Let me make this point to the UPND. By UPND, uh, from the way HH spoke, it is clear to me that HH has started campaigning for his second term. It's very clear. But I want to tell you, by UPND, I want you to listen very carefully. You don't assume, don't be overconfident. HH seems to be very confident that 2026 will just be a walkover. I want to tell you that... Uh, uh, be very careful. Be very careful because some of these things that we are talking about, especially economic statistics, economic indicators, these things people, the majority Zambians hardly understand them. They hardly understand them. So if you are going to go by, no, we are doing this, we are doing this, things that do not really affect the basic life of people. Listen to me very well. I am saying, if you are going to rely on things that do not affect the basic life of people, then you are doomed. You are doomed. This issue of millennium, this issue of commodity prices, these are big issues. And whilst you are trying to sort out the debt restructuring, the debt mountain, you cannot ignore the issue of commodity prices. You cannot ignore the issue of fuel. You can't ignore that. And I'm telling you, 
if you are not careful with the attitude that you have, because you also have this attitude, you know, you are overconfident. You are really overconfident. But I can tell you by UPND, you are going to have it very difficult. You are going to have it very difficult. And I want to tell you, very difficult, not even before, not even, not even 2026. You might have a challenge even before 2026. The way you are handling some of these things, hey, I'm watching and I'm like, mm, these guys. Don't think that intimidating people into silence, that uh, it's good. I saw the journalists who were asking questions and the way the president was answering. To be honest with you, me, I was not impressed. I was not impressed the way the president answered to that journalist, who uh, are KBN. I was not happy. But I was not happy with the way the president handled the question that came from that journalist, I think from, uh, from Millennium, Millennium Radio. Uh, that was quite emotive. Eh? That was quite emotive. The president charged. But you know, those questions that you are trying to put aside, those are things that people want to hear. That is what makes political sense to a lot of people. You can't ignore the kachepa. You can't ignore kachepa. As a politician, don't ignore the, the rumors. Don't ignore the propaganda. Don't ignore the, uh, the innuendos. Don't ignore them. Don't ignore them. Address them squarely. You can't respond like that to say, people are saying that you have signed line the vice president and the president gets charged into emotions. This question is irrelevant because it's basically said it's irrelevant. But those are relevant issues that people want to hear. They don't want to hear about IMF. They are not interested. They don't want to hear about IMF. They don't want to hear about China. They don't want to hear about Eurobond. They want to hear how much is the bag of Billy Mill. They want to hear uh, who is in government and so on and so forth. They, there is something that is testy in the minds of the people politically. And as a politician, you would not be a good politician to ignore what tastes sweet in the minds of the people. In the minds of the people, you need to address that. That is the, that the, the press conference, the entire press conference was for the elite, people who can understand. But what about the woman in the compound? What was in that message, in that press conference of today? It was the last one of this year. What did HH say which resonated with the woman in the compound, with the woman on the streets, with the youth on the streets? What did he say? which resonated with that young person. What resonated? From my point of view, the press conference was full of, you know, uh, uh, full of, uh, 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 what is this, elitist language, aristocratic uh, uh, content. That is what was there. But with the people, mm -mm. and so be very careful with 2026, 2026, be very careful. You may be thinking of Mingalato and whatever, whatever, but when people change their mind, when they turn around, it's very difficult to bring them back. And UPND, you still have a chance. But if next year goes on like this, I can rest assure you that HH will lose presidency even before 2026. I'm telling you this. HH will lose presidency even before 2026 if the status quo continues. That bubbling with elitist language will not help HH to retain in second term. And the attitude of, you know, the Chola boys around, of making the president, telling the president that everything is working, everything is working, even what hasn't been done, even things which are at the point of an idea, it is just an idea. It is just an idea. And you are talking as if it has happened. You are busy babbling about CDF, CDF. You can babble about CDF as much as you want. You can talk all you want from here to heaven. 
But CDF, from my point of view, from my analysis, CDF has not reached the ground. CDF, CDF has not yet touched the lives of the majority Zambians. It hasn't. It is so much spoken about, but the people on the grounds have not yet felt the impact of CDF. The youth out there have not yet felt the impact of CDF. Free education, you can talk as much as you want from here to America. That free education has not yet been appreciated by the poor people that it is targeted for. It hasn't. It has not yet hit them for them to appreciate. If, if you think it has, you will see what will happen in 2026. So some of these things, be very careful when you are boasting about them because they can just be in your mouth and not in the lives of the people. I think I'll leave it here for, for tonight. Um, I'll leave it here for tonight. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. Alright, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutati Mpondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.